Here's a quick look at the connection point between Google My Maps and regular Google Maps. Now, Google My Maps is something that anyone with a Gmail or a G Suite account can create. And once you've created a My Map, you can keep it private to yourself. You can share it with select people, or you can share it out to the world. In this case, I've shared out this map of Sonoma Valley wineries to the world. And there are two ways that you can add pins to a Google My Map. One is you can import a spreadsheet, and the other way is that you can manually add locations to a map or add pins, and that's what I've done here. The benefit to the latter is that if you click on an icon, and you can see you can choose what the icon should be, it will bring up a Google Maps side panel, which shows you photos from Google Maps and also shows you a link to view in Google Maps. So if I click on this link, it will take me to a standard Google Map, and I can do everything that I can do with Google Maps. Send to my phone, or let's say I want to plot directions. I'm flying into Oakland. So I can look for Oakland International Airport, and then see the directions. And I can do the same with any of the other locations. I could even map among locations using just some simple cut and paste.